Hi everybody and hello to my and welcome to my channel thank you for um, following me uh, as I say to you in the last tutorial here we have to add um, some parts to this assembly if you complete your um, episode in the um, in the cylinder head now we can use it here click on browse and uh, send the head right and put it here to add mates click mates and add mates uh, between these and between this and this one and this one we can verify it's all thing is okay uh, the same thing we have to add now the camshaft we have to add two camshafts click here to add two camshafts Mm, where is the next one? Uh, seat ring. I have to add two seat seat ring. Then you you can uh, you can add all the seat ring if you want and make your assembly. Uh, the tappet and the valve. We have to make an assembly with this. I will add the valve guide. Add two of them. Then I will create an assembly from the tappet. Here, go to File, make assembly from the part. Click here, insert the tappet, and go to valve zero point uh, valve zero point one, and put it here. Then you have to add this mate okay then save your file like an assembly like this one awesome val and i will add 0 0.1 like reference in the tutorial then now you can return to the global assembly and import this valve we have to use two valves okay now let's start by these go to mate here and here I have concentric okay then click and drag your reference is this one okay click here and here as you can see here because we have to add another part here between this and this one okay mm, the same thing in this camshaft you have to adjust it to this one okay now you you can hide this Mm, where is height there? I can see a uh, height is here. Then you can use this one.
and this one okay uh, the same thing here I think it's okay without seeing it from here between he, this and this click OK then between this and this one click OK and we have just to add this with this one I think it's okay he's here the last one is this one with this one click OK now we have to add a mechanical mate uh, between this can and this one but another thing uh, we have the same cam, the same um, valve, and then we'll add this one. Okay, when you when you put uh, when you put the mechanical mates like cam, I have just to add it in, to this one, and we have the same result in this. Uh, go to mechanical mates and choose here cam here you can choose your cam and in cam choose this one click ok I don't know what's the error is the same thing I have this and if you rotate this one we have the result ok the same thing in the on all of these and um, all of these uh, valves you add I think in SOLIDWORKS I have problems with these cams uh, but if you add a motion study uh, and add here a spring I think a spring the name is spring spring here and add all forces and uh, rotation motor motor here and I think we have uh, any errors okay um, now it's time to see you goodbye and see you in the next series in SOLIDWORKS we have to add a relation like a belt between this rotation and this uh, translation of the valve uh, we have many many parts we have just begin this uh, engine we have just starting this engine mm, you have to show this component and show this one um, many people asking me uh, to add tutorial uh, to how uh, you can render this in KeyShot I will try to make uh, some just a uh, few, tutors, uh, few tutorials to, to how to do that then uh, thank you for all uh, subscribers if you have any question don't hesitate to post it in comment and uh, if you like to share my channel, it's uh, good to me. Um, see you next tutorial, and uh, thank you for watching.